I just got done filming the video you're about to watch and I just wanted to hop on real quick and say my apologies for my arm being a bit shaky as I film this video because I am holding the camera up with my hand and despite working out as often as I do, it started to get tired as time went on. Even though this is such a short video, my arm started to give a little bit. And obviously as I'm talking and being genuine with my interaction with you guys, I'm gesturing with this hand and it's inevitably shaking the camera in my right hand. So sorry about that. If it ends up being too bothersome for you to actually watch, pretend it's radio and just listen to me. Okay, so I will cut off now and let's start with the video. All right, guys, I just got to my friend's house for a cookie exchange. I am obviously filming this video in advance because let's be real, when this goes live, I'll either be asleep in my bed or just waking up and certainly not looking like this. But anyway, I just wanted to hop on real quick and say Happy New Year to all my lovely subscribers and anyone else out in the YouTube world that comes across this video. I hope 2020 is a fabulous year for everyone out there. I hope it is a year where dreams come true, goals are met, love is found if you're looking for love. I just hope it is an all around awesome and fantastic year for everyone out there. Does anyone have any resolutions for the new year that they'd like to share? If so, please include them in the comments down below. As for me and resolutions, you know, it's not so much anything that I'm starting new for this new year, but rather it's kind of a continuation of things that I've been working on over time. One big thing for me is weight loss. That's a whole Pandora's box and could go off on a many, many minute tangent, but it's something that I'm always working on, so I hope to continue working toward that goal of losing weight. And in conjunction with that, a big part of it is wrangling in my sweet tooth. If you know me, and if we've had this conversation before, you have probably heard me say, if the sweet tooth was a literal tooth, I would have had it extracted. That's how wild my sweet tooth is. And I feel a big part of why weight loss for me is a bit of a struggle. So. In this new year, I'm hoping to kind of continue keeping a hold on that sweet tooth, um, being more mindful of my cravings and how often I indulge in them and just making smart decisions in that regard that will hopefully lead to weight loss over time. The next thing would be finances. That's also, again, a continuation of things that I've been practicing over time, just being smarter with my money, managing it better, saving more, using my money toward things that will give me money back, you know, investments, not material things that as soon as you buy them, you lose money. So those I would say are my biggest things, just, you know, being mindful of my health, weight loss, the sweet tooth and money. So if you have any resolutions in your mind for this new year, like I said, share them in the comments down below. If you're coming across my video, randomly because of YouTube algorithms, recommendations, things like that. Hello, my name is Claudine. I would love it if you would consider subscribing to my channel. Hit that subscribe button down below and ding the bell so that you are notified every time I do upload a video because I'd love to have you here and joining me on all the videos that I post. I talk about luxury goods, uh, contemporary, practical, mid-range items, food, sweets, we just said I love I love sweets. It's just a variety of topics that I like to touch on on my channel kind of based on what I want to talk about and uh, you know just sharing them with you guys. So if that sounds like something you'd be interested in like I said hit that subscribe button and if you're obviously a subscriber thank you so much for being here watching this video. Like I said I hope and wish all of you a happy and blessed 2020 and I will see you in my next video. Bye!